Jamball Zoo is getting ready to officially open a brand new exhibit. This comes less than three weeks after the zoo's new pygmy hippo suddenly attacked and killed an antelope. 13 on your side's Veronica Ortega joins us live from the newsroom this morning. Veronica, we did try asking zoo officials more questions about that deadly incident. They say they're ready to move on. Emily, that's right. They declined to comment further on what happened to Chopper. Instead, they want to focus on moving forward and celebrating the already popular new habitat. The pygmy hippo is named Jahari. He's about seven years old and weighs in at a whopping 600 pounds. He's an herbivore that spends a large part of his day hunting down heads of lettuce scattered about his habitat. Pygmy hippos come from West Africa and perform and prefer warm temperatures and warm water, so he's loving the weather right now in West Michigan. An animal care supervisor says this exhibit is a great example of green practices being put into place at the zoo like water and energy conservation. Once you see Jahari running around the yard and just his cute antics that he has out there, there's no way you're not going to fall in love with him. So being able to connect our visitors face to face with something they're probably never going to see otherwise in their life, we just hope it inspires them to really care and have a positive impact on wildlife and wild places. To celebrate, the zoo is hosting its summer spectacular event starting today through Sunday. There will be live music, food, and more fun animal activities. Jahari is getting a girlfriend soon. A female pygmy hippo named Penelope is coming to John Ball Zoo later this month. Pygmy hippos are an endangered species, and the zoo hopes the pair will mate in the future.